Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Monday 6th of June by our graduate students and instructors. This is the a clip from AP, just a second, where who's showing that this is a NASDAQ and as you see NASDAQ CFD was here sold with the tightest stop loss when it uh, shows sign of rejection in here so this is in fact let me show you on the 30 minute chart and four hours you see clearly rejection here because this level got rejected uh, from home what you see here this level on a, a larger time frame got rejected so you see it's going down now and so based on that you can see a channel here in a smaller time frame and take it so that's the reason uh, we see that AP shorted let me see the end of trend okay. so this is end of clip so AP sees this opportunity in macro charts that it got rejected then sees this channel in fact but anyway it's kind of sideways so it's kind of going sideways here versus here but this has very good indication that this is lower than this one so because it the buyers couldn't take the price here and even at this level lower got rejected rejected you can find opportunity around this area to enter and take profit here and that's what he's saying he sees here so this flat become channel and channel slope become more and more so and this is dynamic channel this become center this become one force upper area and this is entry very sharp here so risk reward is very low because the most is for example here but the reward uh, is already trailed so this is stop loss was here and, the, and you see now the reward is this much so far and uh, so it may seem sideways but we know the sideway can be traded between the very well defined channel with the path system because you can find micro swings between uh, there with very tight stuff and high probability and uh, trade trade it very well and this is a good example uh, of medium risk uh, to low risk because the macro is sideways but the structure and trading charts are kind of trendy uh, thanks AP for this trade that was nice and showing one example of the trade uh, using three time frames and path system to find high probability uh, good risk to reward ratio area uh, Yasin posted this picture and is gonna send video on that to show that uh, he's, he's trading S&P using a forex broker in form of CFD and this is his trading chart and you see channel entry and he will explain the detail himself directly using his video uh, later on today uh, so mg shared this clip shorting uh, us tech which is again nasdaq uh, this is five minute one minute chart and you see uh, his entry when this area broke and then it's having pullback so you see a channel again as a trading channel here and so this structure here sorry this structure here after breaking at this level this level now this level is rejected therefore you can see a downward channel and you see in a smaller time frame so he see the entry here where he sees the entry here this channel again with the good risk to reward ratio so entry is correct around this area 
on force of channel stop loss is correct initially here then it's trail and target uh, let me see if he's gonna yeah, he's putting usually target on the uh, middle or this channel depends on the um, exit strategy now his target is touched and that was the end of his clips and had multiple targets so thanks for sharing this trade uh, gh also i think he had another clip let me see so he had another trade that he sees again uh, re this down kind of trend the macro is sideways but anyway this area is is accelerating and showing that can reach this area or the next target so he entered here at very nice area with this slope now the slope is accelerating and it's gonna be like that so he's having target here and here and let me see his video so that is the end of his video that the price went all the way to reach the targets the two targets um, so thank you very much uh, mg for sharing this trade with all the students and also Jan sent this clip uh, to me for uh, 50,000 combined uh, as you see he sees the macro here on uptrend and taking this channel in the structural chart uh, using 50 tick chart here for the better entries so let me go fast forward so these are his trades on 50 tick charts that is uptrend channel and uh, just a second i go faster so you see his channel his channel that he sees here the momentum is lost and this last one that broke the trend line one time here two time here these are entry area exit area most mostly three targets are touched then here momentum is completely lost he didn't reach the second third target so he has stopped trading <coughs> and this shows the last trade and this combined result 2500 profit for the day thanks Jan for sharing these trades and everyone hope, hope these trades are useful for you and let us know if you have any questions about the application of PAT on different markets and have a wonderful day